Hey guys, Travis here. Today I'm going to show you how to get App Launcher. Now you're just going to want to go into Google or whatever browser you have. Type in App Launcher and just search for it. And you're going to go to the their website there. Go to Downloads. And then you can either follow that their video there but you want to pick whatever download is for your system so for windows you have windows or a mac or whatever and then you want to download it now you're going to get this file now what we're going to do is you want to open up it in the downloads folder uh close your browser and you drag it over and you want to go into new after you want right click and go to new folder and you create a folder named at launch or whatever you want to call it and you want to drag in the file we just downloaded into that file there and you want to open that file up and you want to open App Launcher and just run that application. It's going to create a bunch of folders inside the folder you just created and it's going to run this uh, downloads program or whatever you want to call it. It's a console uh, and then you just want to let this run. Alright here you just want to you can either leave either leaderboard it's enabled or not and then you want to press save now here you want to open up your account. So what you want to be going to do is you go over to the tab on the right that says account, and you want to type in your your email for your Minecraft uh, account and password. Then you want to press add. Then you want to switch to it. So you're going to press yes, and then it's going to download your skin for your Minecraft character and everything for your character. And then next thing you want to do is you want to go over to packs and you want to get you can pick whatever pack you want and to create get the pack you want to press new instance and you can either select whatever version you want to install or not and then you want to press install and some some of these mods they have optional mods that you can get that are usually client side so I'm gonna pick lucky blocks and vein miner and then if you can pick whatever you want you can pick all of them if you really want to and then we're gonna to want to press install down there on the right and then this installing it's gonna probably take a while because these packs are usually big most of them. Uh, some of them are kind of small but they usually take like a couple minutes to download just depending on your internet speed of course. Alright now that's done you brought and press OK and to go to this pack you go over to instances they created a new instance and you can press play and then if you didn't say uh, the remember your password, it's going to ask you for your password for your Minecraft account again. Just let, let that load and then just let everything run. It'll start opening up the uh, mod pack for you and it'll just run everything, make sure everything's good for you. And then it's going to open up Minecraft for you and it's going to start constructing all the mods and it's going to run Forge. And usually this will take a little bit to load because it has to load so much other than just regular vanilla Minecraft that doesn't take as long to load but now that you've added so much it's gonna take a couple uh, minutes just to load everything in depending on how beefy your PC is or laptop alright now that we load it in usually Sky Factory it takes a little bit to actually run on so what I usually do is I move my mouse around and then once it's all loaded in you're gonna see here that these two characters are gonna start to move that's when you know that everything's all loaded See right now they just started moving. So now I'm going to go into a single player mode, create a new world, call it whatever you want, set whatever settings, and you're going to press create new world. And once we load in here, there we go. We're now in Sky Factory. I just changed it out modded Minecraft. It's really simple to make. I hope you guys enjoy this video, and I hope this helps you a little bit. Alright guys, well, that's it for now. Thank you for watching, and I hope you have a good day. I'm Travis, and I hope to see you later. Bye.